wait till the end. Oh, okay. It's only a little block. Getting prepared. Thank you. Love you. <laughs> Bernie's like, we'll only sell the house if we have yeah. that minivan. Yeah, Nolan's like, okay. <laughs> you can have it. <laughs> hey. <laughs> <laughs> Good morning. Oh, it's so blurry. Oh. Hey, what's up? Hello. What is okay? That's a little zoomed in. What is up, guys? Thanks for. Oh my God, my sweater is so orange. Whatever. Thank you so much for choosing to come back to another one of these videos. Um, pretty sure my camera's gonna die. I'm going to sew something. I put up one of the question things on my story and I said, what should I sew for a YouTube video? None of you guys will watch anyways. And I guess that was too much shade because no one answered. Oh my god, my battery's already gonna die. All right, I'm back from a little rest. I'm even more tired than I was before. But, I realize what I'm gonna make. So, I think I'm gonna make a shirt. <laughs> How, you may be asking? I have no idea. But we're gonna try our best, so first, Let's look at my fabric, okay? All right, so I'm pretty sure this is all of my fabric. Maybe. I think these are like pre-made scrunchies that I've given up on. And then this is all, oh, okay. This is all the fabric I have. I can make a shirt out of this fabric, right? It's kind of fuzzy, soft. And then I don't know what I'm gonna make the straps out of. But I thought maybe I'll put like the back as like this. It's like silky, kind of satiny maybe. Um, because that might be cute. Um, yeah. Hmm. Uh, so a little disclaimer. I know basically nothing about sewing or how to sew. I made scrunchies for a while and they weren't bad. But I feel like I kind of cut corners. I didn't like learn how to do it realistically. And so this is going to be me winging it. Um, I'm excited for the back. I think that's going to look cute. I just don't really know. Well, A, I don't even know how to like size it correctly. Because like, I don't know. Should I make it like a tube top? I don't know. This is gonna be difficult. I shouldn't be wearing a sweatshirt for this. Whatever, okay. So maybe what I'll do is I'll um, like wrap it around myself to get, I don't even know, like should I make it like a flat top or like, should I make it like, like a, like a V kind of thing? Okay, so it seems like I just put, Okay, well, A, this looks like a blank, or like a towel. I don't really know. Maybe what I should do is cut a piece of the back and then size it accordingly. So right now, I'm grabbing my fabric cutting scissors <laughs> and I'm gonna try to make sure that I cut a piece of this black fabric that is the same like width as my pink fabric. It looks like it's gonna be a long shirt. 
whatever. So I guess now the only thing left to do would be to try sewing these pieces together. And I just remembered that this fabric that I'm using, this pink fuzzy stuff, is so thick. Like, it might not even pass through my sewing machine, but we'll hope. It just looks wrong. This way instead, like a crop top. Hold on, aye, aye. The side, this side is the inside. So I'm gonna put the inside down, I think. The inside goes down, I get it now, okay. And then... The inside doesn't go down, does it? Yeah, okay. No, wait. Calling on the girls. Please don't do that. Who would have thought that I can do something with my life? So what happens if I'm wearing this shirt and it rips? So this is our seam. Let me zoom. And it's not even like that bad. It's a little like, like a, I don't know how to describe, like it's kind of scrunched because the, I think I stretched this fabric too much, but like, I think it, it has the possibility to look good. So, oh, hello. <laughs> now comes the time when I have to like figure out um, like how much of my torso I need, how like, Measurements would be the terminology that one would use, but not me. Okay. comes to worse I can just like cut what I sewed and then like redo it I guess I don't really know how do people make clothes Maybe it does in the camera. Um, but I think what I'm gonna do is like fold this in and then, um, oh good, classic. So yeah, we have like, see look how much excess and then, yeah. So, okay. I guess I could try putting it on though. I don't hate it. Like, you can clearly see through it. But it's not like the worst, you know what I mean? Like, it's soft. That's like the only plus it has. I think I'm gonna change my um, thread to white so that it won't be as visible on the pink fabric, but I don't know. I wonder if my mom's gonna be impressed or like confused as to why I would do this. Now it just looks like it's gonna be really big, but whatever. I need 
mm, I'm gonna need a dark fabric or should I just do white as a style kind of thing if I have white I'll do it but I don't know if I do Calling all the girls, look I have white. I don't know why that song stuck in my head and I apologize. I'm gonna stop filming for a bit. We have a problem. I just used all my white. This is empty now. On the bobbin. This is so unfortunate, I don't know what to do. I suppose I'll use this off white that I found because this is good. <laughs> so I hem the bottom, and it's not that bad. You know, it's not good. I mean, like, it's not the quality you would get at a store. Oh, that's the wrong side. You're looking at the wrong side. I'm looking at the right side. But it's kind of fun, kind of, kind of fresh and fancy. Um, maybe... I don't know. I mean, like, people are going to want, like, this vintage shirt, right? Like, people are going to be like, where'd you make? Not make. Well, maybe they'll say make if they see the penmanship or whatever, craftsmanship. But, um, yeah. <sighs> it's been, like, a half hour of trying to make this. So I think now I'm going to try to figure out how to cut the top part to my liking. Um, and I'll get back to you. So I put it on and I like just made this line for like how I want it to be. And then I think I need to cut a little bit of like the armpit because it goes up a little high and I'm not really into that because it's going to get sweaty. So, yep, that's the plan. Okay, so like this, this is like cute. I'm proud. Look at the neckline. And now... See, right now I look stupid because I have like little areas for straps and I don't have straps yet. So I could use some of the fabric I cut off. I don't really know what I want for straps. Okay, so these are what my straps look like. Um, they're not the cutest, but I think they'll be functional. You know, they'll be like kind of thicker. They, this reminds me of something, but I don't know what it is. So we're just gonna have to wait and see if I find out. Attach them to the back. You know, I think I finished. I have a shirt. All right, so in conclusion, um, this is the shirt that I made. Um, it functions as a shirt, all I'm gonna say. Thanks for watching. <laughs>